Big money and be big a, dreams. <laughs> the American dream is going to come true for us, yeah? Hopefuls lined up this morning at the 7-Eleven in Hyattsville to get their ticket for a shot at tomorrow's Mega Millions jackpot. It's, it's nice to have and not need than to need and not have. <laughs> the jackpot is currently estimated at over half a billion dollars, the highest winnings ever. Faye Harris says she would use some of the money to give back to those who helped her. I was in two shelters and they helped me out tremendously, so I would like to donate um, some money to the two shelters I, I was in. Others agreed they'd share their newfound wealth. I want to make everyone in my family a millionaire. Well, I might buy my daughter a Dodge Charger or something like that. I certainly would share it with my uh, my community, my church, uh, and my children. Those are the priorities for me. But others have more personal dreams. I'll travel the whole world. Get my son out of my house. Just keep it myself. I like to play with money, you know. <laughs> Mega Millions officials say the odds of winning the jackpot stand at about 1 in 176 million. It's amazing how there's so many people in the world and nobody can hit that number straight, you know, like all of them. Well, sorry everyone, but I'm actually pretty sure that I have the winning ticket. And I've already thought about what I'm going to do with all my money once I have it. I'm thinking I've always wanted a boat, and not just any boat, I can probably afford a private yacht. But I'll probably still have a few more million left over after that. In College Park, I'm Annie Emberlin, CNS-TV. I'll see you all later. I'm going to go check out some boats.